Hi, I'm Grace, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make corn flour slime. The ingredients you'll need to do the experiment is a bowl of corn flour, a jug of water, a tablespoon, and a bowl. Firstly, I'm going to add four tablespoons of corn flour to the bowl. Next I'm going to add a little bit of water to the bowl slowly at a time until this resembles a thick liquid. Once you've added a bit of liquid, stir in between goes. As you can see that's obviously not enough liquid so I'm going to add a little bit more. Keep adding until you, there's not there's no corn flour left visible. Now as you can see, you can see why the experiment is called corn flour slime. This liquid is now extremely thick and quite hard to stir. We're now going to try and make it into a ball. That'll do. It, once you try and squeeze it, it turns to a solid, but the minute you stop moving your hand, it turns back into a liquid. What happens if you try and sink your hand in? Can you pull it out quite easily? Not as easily as you would have thought, because at the bottom it is quite sticky. If I drop a penny in, could you try and pick it out? It's a little tough to get out. Especially the part of trying to find the penny. What happens if you try and, if you try and tap the liquid? Well, as you see, it looks like a liquid. You would think my hand would sink right to the bottom. But as I'm feeling it, it does feel quite like a solid. And if you put, put pressure onto it now. It's quite hard. So do you actually think it is? What type of properties is it? Is it a solid or is it a liquid? It's one of those where it's a mixture of both. It can look like a liquid, but once you apply pressure, it is actually a solid. Thanks for watching, and I'll try this experiment at home.